what's going on guys welcome to another video um for today's app shade episode we have a comment from niger uh i believe he is from sahil informatic technologies and his question is how can i have a list of unique items from a list of repeated items well this calls for a very uh, specific uh, expression that we have in app sheet which is unique so we will run through uh, what we can do using unique in app sheet and of course without further ado let's check it out all right guys so to demonstrate the unique uh, drop down let's say for example we have multiple uh, repetition of the similar product or same product uh, in this case we have uh, coffee so you can see coffee appears twice same goes to tea okay which means the we want to make sure the drop down that we have in the orders table later on will be unique okay then we have the orders table okay so this is where basically the transaction happens now once we have the setup sort of ready then we can head on to create the app which i already did okay so you can see there is the products uh, view here and we have the orders view so to make sure that we have created the uh, drop down taking the unique uh, entries from products table since we have two coffees here and two teas so we want to take only one of them and make it unique in our drop down so to do that in the orders table and under product ordered we head on to the data validity where we will find the expression so we would need to put our expression here and of course the expression that i use is unique select and from the products table and here i will extract the product name okay so of course um true means we want the condition to be regardless so it will be all items in product name under products table okay so once we save this uh, let's give this a try so in orders if i uh can okay, mind let's just edit the ones that we have here under john doe so if i were to select the drop down under product order here you can see the coffee and tea no longer appears twice or it's only taking one of them to, so it is now unique to the drop down okay so this is how that uh, you can actually use the unique expression to make it uh, present the result as such okay so give this a try so i hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to drop a like if you find this video useful and if you haven't subscribed please do so so that you'll find more contents like this in the future and do let me know what else you'd like to see in the comment section down below i'm aris azaha thank you very much for your time and i hope to see you guys in the next video so take care bye bye